straight. Here we go back. This is the moment. Tonight is the night. We'll fight till it's over. So we put our hands. Hello, what is going on chaps? Coco Pops here. Welcome back to the channel for more Black Ops 4 Zombies content. We're on the map Blood of the Dead and we're going to be showing you 5 working wall breach glitches using the Path of Sorrows after the 1.17 patch. Now big shout out to Zline for noticing the Path of Sorrows method still works. Unfortunately the solo method where you just run in towards the walls and double tap pause is patched. You're going to have to use the Path of Sorrows to do this glitch now which is Pretty much the downfall to it because you can only use one special weapon. But regardless, it's pretty OP and I'm going to show you how to do it anyway. You want to make your way over towards the Michigan Avenue. You want to pull out your Path of Sorrows. Make sure it's at stage 2 so you can dash in towards the wall. And as you dash in towards the wall, you want to double tap pause. And if you've done it correctly at the right time, as you can see, you're going to go through the jail cells after the 1.17 patch. Now you can make all the zombies pile up just in this one location here. Or you can do it in multiple other locations around the map on Blood of the Dead, there's quite a lot of jail cells you can get into but if you want to go down in towards the Citadel tunnels like you've seen in the starting of the video what you're going to have to do is be super quick about it and make your way over towards this location right here now because you don't have Ragnarok you're going to drop down you'll be instantly on 5 health so you're going to have to run and jump over towards the other side next to the Citadel tunnels as fast as you can so you do not hit another death barrier remember you've got to do this super quick so you can get over here now I basically brain farted when I got inside this spot, it's been a while and I did not know how to get over towards the other side, I thought there was a little small barrier I'd jump onto like this barrier right here to the left hand side then i jump onto it, but all you have to do is simply run and jump onto the barrier from this barrier right here you can see in the video and you should land on top of this, inside the pillar sorry, right next to all the zombies. Now you can click the drops inside here, I'm just going to play the video through, show you the other spots, it's the exact same method, dashing into the walls as you double tap the pause. There's five locations all together. I'm just going to play the video through. It has been Coco Box. Drop a comment, subscribe if you're new, if you thought the video was helpful. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Enjoy. Bye bye.